Good morning and welcome to a cold and frosty 14th of December. The first part of my journey today was pretty magical and I don't want to overdo the driving footage but it's just so pretty. <laughs> The second part of my journey, however, was spent sitting in heavy traffic due to the train strike that happened today. So I didn't have time to say hello to you when I pulled up in the work car park. There then followed a very busy and productive day at work. So aside from filming some of the beautiful snowy scenes just before I went in, that's about your lot for the day. And you now join me as I'm leaving work and heading home. I'm home from work and I'm eating a party ring, but it's a bit stale, so I kind of regret it. Anyway, I'm just in the bathroom. Um, I'm about to be a future friend because tomorrow, so yesterday, I, d I haven't edited yesterday's vlog yet because it was a nightmare. <laughs> so I didn't get the chance to do anything. So I'm about to do that now I'm home. But because it was such a nightmare, and then I've been at work all day today and tomorrow is gonna be equally busy. Um, I'm going to be a bit of a future friend and do one of the tasks that I had set for myself for tomorrow, which is the hand washing. So I'm going to sort out which of these things is going to go in for hand washing proper with my hands, which is going to go into the machine hand wash. Some of these things survive perfectly fine and some of them are going to have a combination of the two. So I've got like things like jumpers that need hand washing. Um, they can easily go into the machine. I've got Three of those so they'll do and then all of my hand knit socks they can go through the machine but I'm going to give them a bit of a, a bath and a soak first um, and the ones that have been washed before I'll do together and the ones that haven't been washed before I'll do separately that was Phoebe coming in she's getting ready for trampolining she's wearing her birthday football top that my mum got her Looks nice. Phoebe's an Arsenal fan. Dan's a Liverpool fan. <laughs> you looking forward to trampoline? It's the last one before Christmas. Yeah. It's going to be cold out there. It's minus three today, but it's going to go up to a balmy 13 degrees by the weekend. Does that mean the snow's going to melt? It's already melting. It was melting off the trees on my way home. The pathway into school is really deep with snow. Yeah, it's, it was a, the, the snow's basically stayed and frozen but it's definitely starting to melt. I did notice on the way home that it was falling off the trees because I thought it was snowing again. <laughs> then I realised it was just falling off all the branches. Right, I'm gonna soak some socks in a bowl and get these, one, these jumpers into the machine for hand wash. Future friend. <laughs>
Dan's cooked dinner because I was I got home from work and I've been doing the hand washing and editing and things. What we haven't done. Wow. It looks really small now. Oh. <laughs> I I said, oh we won't need chips. But maybe we would have needed chips. You're having roasted vegetables with a cod and chorizo fish cake. It's gonna be nice. It's mm. the Audi's fish cakes, isn't it? Yeah. We might just have to have a bit of cheese and crackers later. Oh, yeah. Cheese and crackers. Cheese and crackers. Mm. Mm. Do we have any crackers? No. <laughs> Hello. Right, Dan's popped out to go and pick um, Phoebe up from trampolining and Lilia is out at um, another panto uh, of uh, the, a production by some of the students, the older students or the... Uh, the year two students, um, where she goes to college. Do you know when you've got a hair, you can feel that you've got a hair on you, but you can't see it? Ah. Nope. Gone. So I'm on my own in the house, so I thought I'd open my advent. So Dan, bless him, has been doing all the running around this evening so that I could uh, do a few of the, the bits that I needed to do. So I've done all the hand washing and that was fun because my washing machine is in a one of the old uh lean-to out buildings outside which was one of the things we were going to rectify when we got the extension which will no longer be boohoo so when it's minus three it's interesting <laughs> and the light's broken out there as well so i'm out there with a torch getting stuff out of the washing machine but that's all now done so that is brilliant i have been a future friend and got it done and I will not have to do that tomorrow and I could proudly cross it off my list. Um, yeah, so he's gone to pick Phoebe up from her trampolining, which is the last one before Christmas. Did I say that? Yeah, I did. And Lily is at her pantomime. That's where they all are. So, and the cat has gone home, which is great. So I'm completely on my own and I'm going to open my advents and I'm just repeating myself over and over. I've amalgamated my green lampkin ones into one bag now because um because i can i've got the room now what's the day day 14 yeah day 14 don't even know if i've said welcome to day 14 of vlogmas have i even said that no because when i left for work this morning yes yeah, so i left for work this morning and it's a train strike today and the traffic was awful. So it took me way over an hour to get to work and I didn't have time to do a little intro. So, oh, sorry about that. Well, I'll, I'll probably have done a voiceover. Yeah, that's what I'll do. My battery's running out now. Please hold. There we go, all changed. Oh, nobody can accuse me of a smooth and seamless production of these vlogs. <laughs> So day 14 of my advents. So this is this year's Green Lumpkin Yarns one, very music themed. And I'm going to choose one of my, the ones that I re-wrapped from last year, uh, which was Christmas Carol themed. So we'll open this one first. Oh, isn't that typical? It's literally about the only one I didn't put a chocolate in for myself. Stupid me, stupid past me. <laughs> and the yarn is Our Spirits Lives So Short, which is a line from the book that Ebenezer Scrooge says, sorry, coughing, to the ghost of Christmas present, I think. Oh, that is so beautiful. Lovely. And now Merry Music, day 14. These are all beautiful tonal minis this year and they, I, I laid them all out um, yesterday to film for the podcast and they looked so pretty. So I must remember to do that for the vlog as well at some point. Oh, I've got a lovely little stitch marker that looks like a bell. There we go. And the yarn, join together neath the mistletoe. These are all, most of the, li the lines I've read because I'm not singing them in the song. I look at it and go, I've never heard of that. And then I look it up the song and most of the songs I go, oh, 
Yeah, of course. And a lot of you are helping as well because you're commenting and saying that is from such and such a song. So let me see if you know this one. Join together neath the mistletoe. Sorry if you can hear my tummy grumbling away. Join together neath the mistletoe and look at that. That's a lovely, I'd say that's a nice holly green or a mistletoe green, which would make more sense given the name. That's so pretty. Okay, so I've moved all of my Bridgerton yarns into my, sorry, my Bumblebee Acres Fibre Farm yarns, which are Bridgerton themed, into my most favourite Christmas bag of all time because it's got Raymond Briggs illustrations of the snowman and my lovely gingerbread house. <laughs> Love this bag. Right, let's find day 14. 15, 18, 16, 14. Right, got it. Who will it be today or what will it be? A lot of the yarns have been named after characters. Ooh. This looks like it could be a Featherington. No, it's called Promenade. Shall we promenade? Oh, that's lovely. Isn't that gorgeous? Sorry about the light, slightly moody lighting. I find that if I sit here with the lamp right there, then you can see me better and it tends to focus on me more at the, now that we have no daylight at this time of day. So that's my advent. Oh, I've got over my tea advent as well. Oh yes, I can drink those. I'm really enjoying my um, teas throughout the days because it gets so cold that it's perfect to warm you up, making the tea, holding the tea, drinking the tea. It's all an act of getting warmer. So, right, I'm going to leave this here now and I will say goodbye for today. I'm going to light the, the advent candle, light all the candles, get it all looking cosy in here and settle down for a little bit of crochet or knitting or cross stitch. I haven't decided yet in front of the telly with Dan and Phoebe until it's time to go and pick Lilia up. And I will see you tomorrow. Do you know what? I'm really craving Baileys. Mm, but there's a cost of living crisis on, so I might go and get like the Aldi's version of Baileys. Not right now, obviously. I'm in my pyjamas. See you tomorrow. <laughs>